the first time I've been to Auschwitz. Uh, I think it's probably the worst place on earth. I think it is almost without words that I leave here. Um, lessons learned. Uh, this was a stain on mankind. And uh, as an American Jew, I feel especially obligated now to take these lessons, put them to work, uh, try and fight for all the things that our country and that Israel stands for, tolerance, freedom, acceptance, and uh, doing, uh, doing all we can to stand up for justice. Anti-Semitism is still out there. Yeah, there's no question that, that anti-Semitism uh, is still there. It takes many forms. Uh, right now we have a leader in Iran that is committed to the destruction of the state of Israel. Uh, I, you know, continue to uh, do all I can to uh, fight to make sure that uh, Israel uh, doesn't face that existential threat of a nuclear Iran. I know in America we feel very strongly about that and we'll do all we can to stop that. Okay. Would you promote more people to come here, you know, for the whole world? I think whether you're Jewish or Gentile, I think you've got to come here and come here once because I don't know it, I don't know how easy it is even to come back here, but uh, with, with uh, the importance that this holds, I think, for all of us as human beings, it's important people come here. Significance is just to be able to uh, identify my heritage and to never forget for all the future generations. And uh, it's just amazing what the people went through, obviously. And we we're here with the, the 31 survivors from Israel and I'm just thrilled to be here. I just felt as a Jew I had the opportunity to come here and I wanted to be here and participate and do whatever I could to give uh, and instill, never forget, and the uh, confidence to all the people that are here.